All right, let's see. Oh! Right now, we're going to share with you what I'm we can do. Wrong could have done to, to survive. Oh, oh don't no, I'm cutting that <laughs> out the fun. video. Okay, but what I'm getting from this if it's, is if he has a helmet, you're fucked. Mm. Yeah. Detroit Urban Survival Training. We have this and other advanced training for you available in our level three protector memberships. We <laughs> I just got fucking scammed. <laughs> Lagging. All right, so <laughs> now it's working. All right, so it started working. What's up, everybody? It's your boy YFV, aka Jobbers and Goons, and today I got a special guest, my homie and lawyer GB. If you want to say what's up? Yo. Yeah. I'll make sure you're a little closer to your mic. That sounded kind of muffled. I don't. You sound like you're getting self-defense techniques used on them. But anyways. We're doing a, is he a goon or a jobber? And what this is, is basically we're going to live react to someone that's gone viral recently, this self-defense guy. I've only seen one yeah. clip of him in which it was on Twitter, and it was like him edited in to catch this MMA kick from the ground, and it was funny as shit. So I was like, yo, GB, let's react to him and figure out if he's a job or a goon he could be both but we're gonna try to rank him so uh going into the video real quick hit a thousand likes and we'll start doing dumb shit like this on more occasions um obviously his self-defense like this has been going on for 10 years from what i've seen from like the minor research i did he's been doing this for 10 plus years um obviously detroit uh still a dump so <laughs> If it's... you live in Detroit, you're automatically a jobber. Um, oh, no. Don't bring up sports. Yeah, the best thing that came out of Detroit was 8 Mile. But, um, <laughs> don't say yeah. that. I don't go sign that shit. <laughs> uh, no. Hey, shout out to Isaiah was... Thomas, man. I'm not letting that slide. Yo. Shout out to the bad boys. Chill. All right. All right. No. Go back on top. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> We're gonna give him a four goon rating because obviously he doesn't he he doesn't really care to improve Chicago with this stuff. This is terrible advice. This man is said Chicago. Um, <laughs> it's Detroit. Oh yeah, Chicago, Detroit. They they both dumps. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, uh, this is rough. Yeah. Hey, hit the like button to counter Detroit's dislike ratio. Um. Uh, <laughs> so I think he Chicago really does. has a deep dish pizza at least. Facts. Um. I think this guy actually has a job, and so if he's been doing this for like a decade and still yeah, has yeah, his no, job, this is this is his, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, then he's a top. He's he's got to be a god goon. Um, jobbing wise, I don't know what well, that. I have to see. We'll figure it out. But all no, right. no, no. The jobbing wise has to be max too, because like I said, Detroit's a dump. Like nobody's. Yeah, his purpose is to, over there. I don't know if we've seen anyone use his moves. Do the so Lions we'll have a out. win this season? I don't. I, let's move. Yeah. On. Yeah, okay, that's yeah. not my fan base anyway. Comics, baby, let's go! It's footwork so subtle. Let's... How much meter was that? He's about to break it down in slow mo. Let's break it this out. This is reverse grip. All right. It's here to control pitch and angle, but his weapon is hidden here. You normally, what you'll see is their hands in this position. You won't even be able to see the blade. It's <laughs> getting run right up on like that. Blade, <laughs> What is this, Naruto? <laughs> 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 he said the blade is hidden. He what? said, "He said, first of all, they're gonna adapt the rear grip to put the thumb for pressure, but you're you're not gonna see the blade. <laughs> so you gotta defend against. How do I know I'm in a, How do I know I'm in a knife in a knife fight if I can't see the blade? Yo, he said, I can't see shit. It's a knife. I can't see. It's a knife. <laughs> that sounds like me giving you shitty directions on a fighting game. All right." Let's 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 get the break. Now. Position. His hair's on point though. Coming yeah. out, he swings back. Good distance management. Back and forth. As it comes in, you come. Ooh. Caught his ass. Coming in, your hand is going here Ooh. straight. Your body is bent forward, so your guts are not going to be in interacting with the blade. <laughs> he's he's said here, pause. You put your hand. What? He says so. Your guts not interacting with the blade. Yeah, I would be like, so what happens if they do interact? He's so fat, I don't think that blade would reach his guts. 
Oh my god. Look at that small ass knife. That's <laughs> Chill. <laughs> hey, that's Chucky a... would fuck him up. Oh my god. That is that yeah, that's tough. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, it's a dummy knife, but the dummy knife sucks. Like, you're getting attacked with a spork. Like, there's no range. Like, that's... No wonder you kept the blade in it. <laughs> All right, this guy's no. a nightmare matchup for the goons, though. I'm getting Cartman vibes from him. I can't wait to drop that one. Um, we're not done with it, though. Seven hand seconds. next to the blade, where the guard is, pull it forward, and it goes right into your hand. This intelligent option will increase your survivability. <laughs> this intelligent option will increase, will increase your survivability. This man's a walking NPC tutorial, bro. I'd rather just dip. Hold on, let's see the next one. Um, host hostage pistol disarm. Okay. Okay. It's about to get fucking real. Hit the like button. What? Hey. <laughs> right there, Neji. Literal neji movements. <laughs> Shout out to Naruto. <laughs> all your all, all your your pressure points done for. Literally done for. This is some Kenshiro shit. Look at a. Look at death. Look at his hair leaving his body as the fingers connect with the nerves. Look. Look at how his hair. knees buckled just from contact. No, this uh, rate First the all, outfit. Rate he, the outfit. <laughs> what the is, fuck was that? Is he wearing Skechers? Oh shit! Oh, this is a Skecher Force. What's he wear? Uh, let's keep going. This is not a drip test. It's a goon test. He was going the test. eyes. Oh. Oh, he just lost his gun. Okay, so we can for sure say the assailant. Notice how he takes the formation of a Tyrannosaurus Rex. And now I have a, this intelligent option. Wait, so the guy didn't have the gun cocked before that? No. <laughs> so. Alright, let's. Oh! Oh! Top 10 things King Mong could have done to, to survive. Oh, oh don't know. I'm cutting that out the video. Yeah, I'm gonna bleep that. They'll oh, no. never know what you said. I'm gonna bleep it right when the name drops. Alright. No. Nah, but hold up. Peep the Blitz? Ooh! Top 10 things Top Smoke could have known. Can do to increase your survivability no. in a situation where you're armed based off of an armed aggressor. In this situation, V sees me move, he's gonna fire. Watch the speed blitz. <laughs> he just got shot. <laughs> I just thought, is that the video? He's dead. Bullet timer, no. Hold on, hold on, we gotta slow it down. Did he dodge it or did, I think he got shot. I think he got shot. No, are you crazy? I got a. Hey, we'll go half speed. I think his ass got shot. Hold on. No, no, no. Put that shit in the slowest of motions. Max that <laughs> Some shit. Hey, some would say the slowest. Comic Vine is losing their shit right now. Comic Vine saying this man's faster than Thor. Yeah, he might be Thor level. Okay, hold on. All right. Comic Vine is losing their so shit. This guy is. Whoa, you rewound it. That's Steven Seagal. And this. All right, let's see. Okay, let's see if he dodges it. He got shot, bitch. You're such a liar. He just died. <laughs> 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 crying oh i really i was like there's no way he dodged that there's no way he pretended to dodge that and nope that fucker got shot hopefully he was just demonstrating that that movement will get you shot all right try to get him to try to step off line mm. there's no way to get that gun out before he can fire and uh shit hit center mass and repeatedly if necessary from here i reached forward and therefore redirected the barrel and now I can go forward he got and him. fight into the aggressor. <laughs> now the for you is this. Even if he tries to back away, weapon retention-wise, oh even God. if he tries to drop uh, down to the ground, it wouldn't happen because I'm going to go forward, driving the barrel back into him. This increases your survivability because it takes from them 
the ability to redirect the weapon at you. This intelligent option will increase your survivability. I'd like to take this time to thank Bravo Consumer Holsters. This hey, you're not going to get a plug off on my channel, bitch. But... Not with self-defense like that. <laughs> All right, compared <laughs> to his other moves so far, how would you rate... That one, that one was pretty shit. That, that was pretty jobber. Um, he got shot like three um, times. Can I you, mean... Can you drop a larger attack? <laughs> All right. He's trying to... Hold on. All right, so right now he's uh, dueling a grizzly bear. Um, we're going to see how this goes 1v1. Can you drop a larger attacker? He gets goon points if he drops one. Pushing. He's trying to resist. Push up. And then what you're going to do is you're going to drop down. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> we need the slow mo. What? Nah, we're going to run it back normal speed. Did he just do the Ryu normal throw? Bro, what? He used no leverage. He didn't even. I don't think he even put his feet on the guy. You're supposed to like get a hand behind their head too. I don't think he had that either. <laughs> Look at this. Look at the fucking. Bro. What? Look at this. He's just holding on to like one sleeve and just falling. Look, he's just holding his arms. That's it. There's no feet footwork yet either. Holy sh! This guy's crazy. He's really gonna get people hurt. Look. What do you does mean? Have, doesn't have his hands anywhere near his head for control. Not even using his feet at this point. Let's see how he finishes it. Oh! Underneath them. Talk your shit. Drop down. He looks winded. If they have fabric, you grab it. If they don't, it doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah, Jimmy said if they have a windbreaker, grab it. If they don't, it's whatever. I'm sick. He was just so specific, a fucking windbreaker. This is a windbreaker specific class. If they don't, you're just going to hold it here. And as you fall down, you, as they're pushing, you're pushing forward. Your feet are going to go underneath that. <laughs> Shit. Shit. <laughs> oh, hold on, know, hold on, hold on. You know Do how me a favor and type was? this in. Do me a favor and type this in. Type in Ken back throw. Ken back throw? Yeah. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ken back throw one. That should work. Yo, he was just, did you see homie getting it in the corner? <laughs> just disarming everybody. This is who this guy thought he was. Are you ready? Fight. <laughs> <laughs> Yo! <laughs> Got him. Oh my. Oh! <laughs> Short term response training. We're sharing Easy. the tactics we've used over the past 26 years to save our nothing. lives and Literally the lives of others. Nothing. This technique. Hold on, he just gave lore. He just gave lore. This is what they came for, power scaling. All right, hold up. I'm going to chop this fucking video up when I do go back and edit it and so that they have no context to our conversations. Guarantee that. All right, let's see the yeah. Detroit Urban Spuggles Training. We're going to share with you tactics we've used over the past 26 years to save our lives and the lives of others. Yeah, so he's used for it for 26 years to save lives. It worked for us. Here, number one, we take from the aggressor who represents a high level threat. Do not use this unless your life's in danger. High level threat. A bottle, a knife, or extreme condition, multiple aggressors. Your family's in danger. You're in danger. Uh, here, the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna take your foot and you're gonna in stomp into the knee. Mm. This will cause severe damage Whoa, to break the knee and their ability to articulate towards you. Fingers go directly into the eyes. Articulate from here, you. come forward and extend you don't your talk. hand, web your hand right into the high oh. way, striking them down. This intelligent option will increase your survivability. <laughs> that, but what that, happens when that he catch literally phrase gets, is God. Yeah, facts. Yeah, what do you do if they what take that shit? He, 
What happens when he sees you going for his leg and he literally moves? Yeah, what if he don't give a shit? Like, what if he's a tank? Oh, we're in Detroit. And we gotta... Oh, bro. How you gonna make me laugh, bro? Uh, we got a volunteer. Okay, so this is the this is to prove if he's really with it. This is an alleged non-believer. So he should be coming with the heat, right? <laughs> oh, oh, bro, you gonna make me laugh, bro. Uh, we got a volunteer who does not believe gun disarms work, right? Bro, right? He, look, I don't, don't believe. He gonna get you fried out here, bro. Okay, he does don't not do believe, it, bro. Okay, here we go. You, if I move, you gonna, you gonna shoot, right? Yeah. Say, don't move. Don't move, bro. All right, look, all right, that was quick. All right, let's do all it right, over. Try it again, try it again. All, all right, right. he said, let's do it over. Don't move. <laughs> Why don't is he it? saying don't move? Yeah. <laughs> hey, get blitzed. Get blitzed, jobber. If I move, you're going to shoot. All right, yeah. Say, don't move. Don't move, bro. All right, look, all right, that was quick. All right, let's do all it over. Right, all right, he said, let's do it over. Don't move. <laughs> you couldn't do it. <laughs> All right, GB. What do you think of that matchup? <sighs> Detroit's in shambles. <laughs> Detroit is hey, safe. I'm, hey, I'm, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just say it right now, man. I'm gonna say it right now. Detroit better not send their shooters my way if they, if that's how they gonna shoot. That's all. I'm saying. Hey, so apparently he takes this guy without hitting. When was the last time somebody died in Detroit? You can move someone against their will, even when they're much stronger than you, much bigger than you. All right, he's going to walk this way, and I don't want you to fall down. I want you to stay on your feet, okay? You ready? Walk forward. <laughs> <laughs> this is the most aggressive, random thing. <laughs> He literally said, I'm just going to kill this man. <laughs> he said, I don't want you to fall, okay? Right, you ready? Walk forward. Oh! Oh! Okay. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, Detroit Airman Survival Training. The way this works is I went under the nose, and you go under the nose right here. It doesn't matter how strong they are. It breaks the vertical plane and causes them to go back. You can use that as an intelligent option to improve your likelihood of survivability in a situation where. All right, what do you look, think of the he, nose snag? What do you think of that? Look, it's interesting. He needs to start saying, he needs to start saying, here's how this works. It doesn't. That's what he needs to start saying. 10 strike combination in three seconds. Okay. See the hand speed. Oh, I didn't even see it. I Did didn't even see it, bro. I it says swear that guy on a battle pass suit. <laughs> he said a battle pass. That guy bought the battle pass? What the, <laughs> the fuck is all that? <laughs> this man has a platinum <laughs> helmet. If, if, if someone pulls up on you to fight like that, do you even give them the courtesy of fighting back? These dudes obviously have a lot of XP. They they know life the game at that point. Like they're yeah, sweats. this fucking level sixty eight. Okay, so if he first beats of all, him, if a guy can afford that helmet, he doesn't need to rob me. Hey, when That's you've done every thing. GTA heist, like that man I... bought the narcissist <laughs> Playboy Cardi fucking bike helmet for two K. Um. Okay, let's see what happens because it was too fast the first time. Let's go. Oh, oh, oh! Detroit Urban Survival Training. We have Wait, this but the guy tanked it for you. The guy tanked it. Oh, that's why he's got the helmet. Okay, but what I'm getting from this if it's, is if he has a helmet, you're fucked. Mm. Yeah. Detroit Urban Survival Training. We have this and other advanced training for you available in our level three protector memberships. We. I just got fucking scammed. Come on, I gotta see this. I'm sorry. We gotta finish on this. Is he gonna dead ass tell us how to fight a child? Oh! Hold up. Detroit Urban Survival Training. We don't encourage anyone to fight or to resist, but if you do decide to resist, what we want to do is make sure you have intelligent options. 
This is biomechanics, understanding how the body works. Biomechanics? So this position is when a minor is pushed, so the minor is not injuring another minor, or in this case, fighting a larger adult. What he's going to do is a body drop. So he's being pushed back by a much larger person. He drops down by stepping off. Line, yeah, the re throw. Underneath. The aggressor goes over the top. He runs away at freedom. A five year old never do that to me. Impact the person. He didn't punch them. Five year old would never do that to me. I'll hey. throw that little kid. <laughs> He'll pull guard and I'll just fling his ass into the parking lot. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> okay. Get the fuck out of here. Okay, so. Okay, I think that's the first video GB didn't buy into the hype. But besides that, um, my goon rating for this guy is a fucking four because he's a cop selling merch and he's just saying wild shit. So he's a, he's a full, easily a four. He's a god goon. Um, my jobber rating, though, is a four as well because this shit will get me killed. So what do you think? <laughs> <laughs> I think if I'm angry enough to grab a kid, somebody else's kid like that, there's nothing that kid can do at that point. I've already committed to a heinous crime, and no, <laughs> no form of self-defense is going to help that kid hey, at that point. Look, just to keep this in mind, Damian Wayne had a lot of training. But when Bruce Wayne decided to kick him in injustice, it was over. Like, that was it. Exactly. <laughs> it was like, exactly. no, you don't actually scale. Um, or when the adults actually started fighting back in Children of the Corn, even the devils couldn't save them. So, Like, what is a five-year-old going to do if Francis Ngannou decides to grab him? Come on, I'll stop. All right, so what he's going to do is backpedal and then switch offline of the... Nah, but anyways, guys, um, <laughs> we gave this dude easily a... I don't know his name, but he's the Detroit guy. Um, based on what we saw, I give him a full four, tier four goon, tier four jobber. What's your? Anyways, guys, so GB actually cut out there, but me and GB both agreed this dude was a god tier goon and jobber or a divine jobber. So. Anyways, guys, let me know what you thought of the video. If you like these funny reaction cut-ups from me, uh, rating jobbers and goons, let me know in the comment section down below, and let me know with the like button. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. It's me, your boy, YFE, a.k.a. Jobbers and Goons, and I'll see you all later. Peace.